Let's check in with the Gophers as we welcome in Randy Johnson of the Minneapolis Star Tribune. And Randy, no questions surrounding who the quarterback will be for Minnesota, but instead, P.J. Fleck is going with two quarterbacks. How do you see this situation playing out? Well, I, I think that there, he's going to use the uh, pr uh, the non-conference season to help sort things out. My guess is that they'll uh, basically have uh, a rotating situation, and then uh, maybe by the uh, Big Ten opener against Maryland, they'll, they'll settle on one. There's a bye week before that, so that would make uh, make sense to do that. Is there any concern surrounding that in terms of the timing of going with both guys instead of just naming a number one now and riding him through the season? Oh, I think it's just a situation where uh, P.J. Fleck just didn't feel that either one of them had seized the job yet. Uh, he, he, he talked of improvement on, in, on both of them, uh, Connor Rhoda and Demery Croft, but uh, he, he, he felt that he needed to get both ready anyway because he'd have to have a backup considering the, the rigors of Big Ten play. Outside the quarterback position, Randy, where do you see Minnesota's biggest strength heading into Buffalo on Thursday night? Uh, I would say it, it's their two running backs, Rodney Smith and Shannon Brooks. I think they have a, a really good duo there, and uh, I'm sure they'll try to run the ball quite a bit. And, Randy, thanks so much for the insight. We appreciate it. That is the latest on the Minnesota Gophers. Thank you.